welcome back to week 46 of the Iron Man Road to Completion Escape series. It's probably not going to be a full week. I have a feeling that this is the finale. Uh, starting off this week by getting a repeat Varix Brassard. Totally okay. Just, you know, not going to be salty about Barrows. Just got to get it out of the way. So, uh, yeah, back to that, uh, that grind. Um, it's the first thing I did, like, whenever I woke up this morning. Put together my video, started doing laundry, started uploading, and started Barrows. See? No salt. Absolutely zero salt for the back-to-back -back pieces that are repeats. I'm just glad to get more in the bank. That's just upping the bank value, right? So that whenever I probably pop on a uh, wealth evaluator at the end, it's gonna look even bigger. So, Bodhi just put up a new video that actually <laughs> accurately describes my feeling at Barrows right now. And uh, the title is, Drier Than My Sex Life, in all caps. So, I, I feel him there, on like an emotional level. <laughs> I joke, I kid, I actually, I'm, I'm in a dedicated relationship, like everything's going fine. I just thought it was funny. Yes! Oh, that's a Torax hammer, so I don't think it's a complete set, but that's another three out of four. Oh, please. Is, is Torag one of the three? I think it's Darok and Varak, but... Oh, man. So that's repeat, repeat, Torag, Torag, Torag. There it is! Yes! Ah! Oh! Got it! Oh, my gosh. 290 taken care of. Oh, let's just, uh, bam, back to Barrows and uh, equip each of these pieces. There we go. Hell yes. Time to go claim those rewards. All right, and here it is. Turns out I never even picked up the first part of the task set, um, but about the task system. There we go. There's all the lamps into DG, even though it kind of feels like a waste if I do come back to RuneScape in the future. Uh, but it's still quite a bit of XP, uh, seeing as I had about 7 mil to go, and now I've got about 6.8. So glad that is out of the way. Slime Pit Teleport. All right. And, uh, yeah, on to uh, knocking out music tracks. Probably gonna do Rush of Blood sometime soon. Um, we'll see. You'll see in the next clip, at least. So I just went AFK for a little bit and came back, and, uh, yeah, I logged into a really weird thing down here. Let me see. Unlocked. It said I, uh, I've now achieved Taskmaster. Which I don't think is accurate. But anyway, maybe maybe I did, okay? Um, would it be under achievements, I guess? Achievements, task ma Oh! Oh! Beautiful! Yeah, it looks like I did get it. Nice. <laughs> Just uh, was doing a bit of a uh, clue scroll here. Went to have to do some laundry and uh, came back. Turns out I got Taskmaster. I didn't think I would, uh, simply because of Minifos, but maybe it doesn't count, or at least Taskmaster is also under Amnesty? I'm not sure. And there I just fought my Aberrant Spectre champion, with my champion scroll, uh, and it's unlocked all of the music outside of the um, various Minifos ones here, um, except for Exhibit A, which requires me to do the uh, Autoled Man's uh, all of his other stuff, like all of his optional stuff. And uh, then Barbarian Assault. And go all the way through, uh, win a match. And uh, yeah, it's basically that. Rush of Blood and Dungeoneering. And now I've completed the Odd Old Man's wish list. I think I have everything else here uh, for Fur and Seek. Let's see. Yep, that's everything. And... He's probably going to give me an option for something cosmetic again. Yeah, no, maybe. Nothing. And let me make sure. Yeah, nothing. Okay. 
So I think I get a music track by going upstairs. Yes, I'll enter. Oh. Oh, it's the skeletal horror. That's right. Okay. Yeah, so I've got exhibit A. Whoop. I'm out. And so I'm ending off today's gains. Just hit uh, 99.6 mil DG. Uh, thanks to the tokens I had saved up. Puts me 4.65 mil away. Should be able to knock that out tomorrow. Uh, at least most of that. And, um... Yeah, I'm really going to try to get Rush of Blood done either tomorrow or the next day. And uh, then there's the matter of uh, doing Barbarian Assault all the way through at least one time. Uh, but that shouldn't be too bad. So yeah, that's the end of the first day of this week. Probably about two days to go. And I just barely missed it because, well, we're doing the Penance Queen fight. But the pop-up just happened. I got the last music track I needed and Music Maestro. I uh, decided to take a break from Dungeoneering to try and take care of this requirement, and uh, yeah, here we go. Awesome. And I may as well do a bit of a shout-out while I'm here. I uh, basically just picked up two random folks from the BA team's friend chat, and two random folks from Livid Farm, because the only people being there would be Compers. So Speed Cream, Griffin Bork, Abyssion, and Byzus. Yeah, really glad that I got that taken care of. Like, thanks so much, guys. And there we go. Just past wave 20 in Rush of Blood. I'll probably keep recording through the end of it. Um, I was a bit of a scrub, and I forgot my dark light. Uh, but at least I managed to pass wave 20 this time. Uh, so I'm at I'm, I'm happy about that. I made myself some weapon poison, and I uh, made myself a lot of summoning flasks. So, yeah, I was a little bit more prepared this time around. Also, the fact that I'm, I'm now maxed probably had some impact. Um, but yeah, I managed to do it. Now it's just Dungeoneering. Uh, probably not going to finish it up tonight. It will be tomorrow. And uh, I'll put up a video saying whenever I'm planning on uh, comping. Probably be a little bit later in the day because I am going to go watch a movie with my girlfriend tomorrow. Uh, but yeah comp is coming tomorrow all oh, right bam I forgot to uh, stick around there's the slayer master let me see if that got both of them form well enough to impress Morvran pretty sure that's just wave 20 uh, I appreciate some of the stuff I guess I can just bank all uh, reward book this can go into dungeoneering sure and uh, I guess I need to talk to Morvran to actually have that other thing proc. Hopefully, I can leave. Perform well enough in Rush of Blood to impress Morbran. Okay. So let's let's talk to him. Right around here. There we go. That's taken care of now. Make them bleed. Bam, 50k Slayer. And with the end of this floor, I should be hitting 101 million. Dungeoneering. Nice. That's just uh, 3.2 mil to go. I uh, won't be able to finish it tonight. Well, I probably could if I stayed up long enough, but I did promise somebody that I'll wait till tomorrow. Uh, so I will be comping tomorrow. Um, going to put up that video later tonight and uh, announce what time I will be uh, like hosting the event, I guess. All right, everybody, and this is where day 317 comes to an end. Day 318, tomorrow, is the comping day, as I mentioned a few times now. Just going to blow these tokens that I earned today. See, about 2.8 mil there, and I think I earned some more earlier and spent them as well. Uh, so, bam, just about 785k to go. Uh, <laughs> so excited. Um, also, I will be streaming to YouTube, or YouTube Gaming, whatever it's called, uh, during the event. Um, I'll try to stream and record at the same time, but if I'm not able to uh, comfortably on my PC, then what I'll end up doing is just hopping to another clip after I comp and uh, show off the cape and tell everybody that, hey, if you actually wanted to see it happen, see how many people showed up 
you can watch the full VOD. I can link the full VOD that uh, YouTube will save for me. And uh, I may even download it if they have that option. Cut out a clip and put it in for the event itself. Not sure yet. Uh, I'm sure you'll see in the next clip as to what happens. But uh, man, I just... I hope I can actually fall asleep right now. I do have like two hours of DG to do in the morning. I'm just so excited right now. I can't wait, man. <laughs> also, I uh, put up a Dungeoneering guide today, so if you were looking forward to that, um, a solo Dungeoneering or Iron Man Dungeoneering guide. Um, it's not a full guide, but it does give a lot of uh, tips and pointers that I've learned along the way, and uh, should help you get up your XP a little, uh, XP per hour a little bit. Uh, crank up your efficiency a little bit better. Get them gains. And now, day 318. All that's left to do is wait. 68k away. Going to go spend some tokens. I'm not gonna hit it. I'm gonna be pretty close, though. Let's, uh, just buy... Let's see. I will buy myself about 48,533 XP. Leave myself 20k away. Uh, from completing it, and uh, gonna go do Jack of Trades, you know, prep. I've got about two hours to go, gotta set up my stream, and uh, yeah, test out some settings. So I think one of my biggest issues right now is that I'm really low on bank space, so I'm gonna be removing my uh, magic wardrobe here. I should probably, yeah, make sure it's empty, um, but this is the last thing here in my, uh, my little house, my costume room, I guess. Uh, that isn't to the max level. Let's go ahead and make that marble. And uh, I'll probably build a toy box and a treasure chest to max. And magic cape rack, uh, that is the highest magical cape rack. So that is done. Now I just gotta complete everything else. See if I can find some more bank room. Because uh, it is kind of cramped. The other day I went to uh, take off all of my, my gear that was put on for Rush of Blood. And I clicked four. Bam, and I uh, I had stuff still equipped because, um, yeah, I, I was full. I ended up deleting my full uh, gemstone, uh, gemstone golem set, shark set, and constructor's outfit, uh, which will all have to be reclaimed from Diego. But to keep myself from having to do that over and over again, I should probably uh, clean up this a little bit. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the comping stream. Let me know if I'm way too loud right now. I I tested audio levels a little bit, and I changed them up, so... Yeah! It's finally time! Oh, man. Alright, so... We're gonna be starting this out by, uh... <laughs> hey, guys. I'm gonna start this out by doing a Jack of Trades run. Because... I'm only 20k XP off Dungeoneering. Let's grab that old Jack of Trades aura. Pop that baby on. Yeah, I tried to lower the, uh, the volume a little bit on the music. So I'm just going to do a Jack of Trades run in my old style. Going up to the uh, Garajo dungeon. Alright, awesome. So many people on 114. Hunter, Let's get some fishing, though I do get that later on anyway, and uh, normally I look for divination, that was unexpected, oh well, now I head to Taverly, Oh, 
Oh, this guy's back. Does that mean we get free clue scrolls again? Huh. Um, now the stream is going to look a little bit worse than my videos normally do, but that's just because of uh, how I normally record. So you're going to see a lot of artifacting. I'll try to minimize it by not spinning the screen a lot, but it's bound to happen anyway. Just a heads up. Already got fishing, so wood cutting. Light the logs. Cook the shark. Pop that for fletching. Oh, I need that flax. Whoops. Now I gotta make sure this is on. Yep, balanced. Kill one cow. And I get the prayer XP as well. Oh, it's for those raffles. Uh, here I'll get some invention. No, um, I don't think we can enter the raffles. Uh, but he used to uh, give the free clue scrolls back like in CS week, so I didn't know he had other uses. I got stalkers following me. What's going on? <laughs> Grab the guam. Clean that. 17. Forgot to do my thieving over at the lodestone like I normally do, but I can pop it right here. There's 18. Then 19 for free. And a long trek up to the agility course. Approach the world, Guardian. Raxing right here is my friend uh, Influence. I've mentioned him a few times in my series. He changed his name to Raxing because, I mean, that's basically all he does. And there's 20 out of 20. Means I gotta head to, uh, Max Guild, actually, but then I'm going to go to Varrock. Let's see, Max Guild, because I can turn it in here? Or do I actually have to, uh, yeah, I guess I do. I have to go to Prick Lodestone. Talk to Dilwyn. Oh, remove the aura first. Talk to Dilwyn. Grab that hook. Oh man. It's so close. My heart is pumping. And on to Barak. Here we go, boys. Oh yeah, that's right. Forgot about that. I haven't gone to him in uh, quite a while. Let's see if I can find the right song. Going through a playlist right now. I can't even remember the name of it. Ah, there it is. Yeah, I think you guys know this one pretty well.
so many people. Oh my goodness. Okay. Now I'm gonna see if I can buy the cape before the Dungeoneering broadcast goes. Come on. There it is, 120. Can I try? Oh man, that sounds fair. Yes! <laughs> oh man, I gotta make it hooded first. What am I doing? Oh man, let's see. We gotta do... Where's the cape? Can I not do it in here? Oh, I gotta go outside. Gotta go outside to do the emote. Oh man, I'm gonna have to respond to all these people. <laughs> it's insane to me, just... I can't believe it's finally happened. Here it comes. Gotta change my layout just to make sure it can be properly seen. Here's the dragon! <laughs> oh man. And the Taskmaster. <laughs> oh, it's so good. Alright guys, it finally happened. The series is done. I finished it up with a trip to Armadil. Just to, uh, just to kind of wind down. I'm trying to get my Armadil chest plate because I made the remark that... That I have a comp cape on, but I still don't have an armadillo chest plate, which is just, it's its so funny to me. Uh, and that's still the case, <laughs> because it gave me another chain skirt, and not a chest plate. Uh, so, slightest bit of salt, but that salt can't stop me from being uh, incredibly happy right now. Um, man, it it finally happened. I got I got the comp cape. So good stats on it, too. The lovely particles. Oh, man. Well, this is going to be the finale of the series. I should sit in the throne. Oh, I can't. Oh, okay, I can. Yeah, there we go. Sit in the throne. With my bubbles. And, uh... Yeah. Thanks for watching, everybody. Um... I'll be putting up a video in a few days to talk about what the plan is after comp. Um, but I'm just really happy that it's over with. Uh, it was a fantastic experience, honestly. This is something I've wanted to do for the longest time. And um, watching Chills' series uh, like inspired me to do for it, inspired me to do so, uh, inspired me to go for it. And I finally got it. So. That's like another thing off the bucket list, I guess. And uh, yeah, I can't I can't end this by saying I'll see you next week. But uh, thanks for watching anyway, guys. Later.